everybody? It's Chris from the Barrage Cast, and we have a care package in the mail from the man, the myth, the legend. He's Junkyard Jerome Moore, a.k.a. Yankees Cards. My man hooked me up. I was just expecting a few Jose Consecos. He, he told me he had the 87 top, so Peachy and a Tiffany for me. Told me that like last year and shit. But, <laughs> but lo and behold, <clears throat> my man hooked it up. He knows I'm a Nolan Ryan fan, a Conseco fan, autographs the dude's name Chris, dude's making catches at the walls, and he went above and beyond with a sweet ass care package. So without further ado, let's just start this bad boy off with a beautiful, beautiful 5x7 Nolan Ryan Tops Gallery. Check that bad boy out. Beautiful artwork by my boy Chris Penis. Just killed it. Big ass 5x7. I don't have any of these like that of Nolan Ryan. Love Ryan in the Houston Astros uniform. Love him in the Rangers uniform. Uh, still searching for that Nolan Ryan rookie card. Anybody who has a couple of doubles and they want to trade, let me know. Let me slide this super sweet display thing here. I was talking about the 87 Topso Peachy. Here she is. I was expecting it to be a little bit more like um, low end or flimsy or something like that, but it's actually, I feel like it's a little bit more high end than the actual 87 Tops version. The Tiffany obviously is, is the most high end. But uh, I expected this to be like as thin as a sheet of paper and stuff like that. Because I collected, I've, I've seen like the the 90s and 91 Opeaches and those were cheap, ugly, and uh, very low quality. But to my surprise, the 87 Tops Conseco Opeachy was actually pretty damn gnarly. Pretty awesome. And speaking of the, uh, the Tiffany, you can tell it's Tiffany by that beautiful bright back right there. <clears throat> bright back. Did I say that right? Geo. In comparison to uh yeah see this is the tiffany on the right and it's not as bright as uh if this was a regular 87 tops it'd be dark as shit you guys you all know what i'm talking about so again really surprised that those uh that the quality of the opichi in 87 was was that good so super cool on those thank you my friend jerome junkyard jerome or also sent this awesome sean michaels hbk aka the heartbreak barrage Sports King, another awesome artwork. Blah blah blah. Um, I don't know who the um, da, da da. I don't know who the artist is on this one, but man, if I could draw like that, I'd be all about it. Check it out. Kick-ass Shawn Michaels card from my boy. Also hooked it up with a nice Nolan Ryan Ginter mini. Allen and Ginter. Turn that back, and it's an A and G back. Two boys on top of that. It's almost a short print like that also brew crew fans so i got this sweet ass disc collectors a dish robin yiz out also got nolan ryan from the same set airbrush those sweet logos right up out of there also everybody remembers these man these were in all the cereal boxes man it just dumped that i think they came in like a pack of maybe three Something like that. Nolan was in there. Conseco was in there. Boggsy, Mattingly. Love these cards. These ones uh, bring back a lot of memories. And there it is, boys. Look at that. Boom. Look at all those beautiful stats. And he wasn't even done then. This is like half of his career right there. Speaking of baseball cards, you can pull out of cereal boxes. We all love the Captain Crunch ones we could get. No logos didn't really bother us then. I don't think we really knew what was going on back then. We were just like, huh, maybe it was a batting, batting helmet, a batting practice helmet. Beautiful, beautiful. Look how young he looks right there, boys. Awesome, Nolan Ryan. Let's see, this one's from 1981, boys. Whoops. Wait, yeah. Almost thought I hit some button that I shouldn't have. 1981 Fleer boys. He'd already been in the league for dang near a career, most people's career, and this is like half of his career right here. He only has 178 wins there, definitely ended up with more than 300, and he almost has how many strikeouts? 2,000 strikeouts over here? 3,000 ended up with 5,700 something, I think. 
beautiful Nolan Ryan card. Here's the commemorative uh, 35th anniversary. They use the 87 tops um, orders. I wish they would have had all the stats on there, but as with everybody, they just have their career totals. <clears throat> Here's a sweet wild card of McGuire and Jose. Comes out of the, uh, the, 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 the this. <laughs> I can't talk right now. Big Mac and Jose, the Bash Brothers. Wonder if you guys have uh, checked out Netflix. Has a sweet half hour video of uh, the Bash Brothers by my, my buddies, the Lonely Island. Uh, they famous for their hits, uh, Dick in a Box, I'm on a Boat, um, Jizz in My Pants, and now they have another one, and it's uh, 30 Minutes, a visual poem about the Bash Brothers. If you guys haven't seen it, I totally encourage you to. Uh, they have a lot of fun with the, with Mark McGuire and Jose Canseco. Jose has seen it. I saw him tweet about it. He, he actually said he really liked it, enjoyed it, and uh, of course he plugged his shit. If they want to pay him, he'll be in uh, the next video. <laughs> So that's pretty sweet. Um, also got this bad boy from him. Uh, strong man. Uh, let me see. Look at that dude just ripping that bad boy. Brian Shaw. Probably a piece of his shorts or something like that. Sweet memorabilia by the 2017 World's Strongest Man. The competition was held in Botswana. Beautiful. It's a piece of the shirt that he wore right there. Oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. They actually photo match it for you. So I know that that swatch came off of that shirt. I like that. Sports Kings doing it right. And then last but definitely not least, or second to last, you know what I already said it. He knows that I'm always hunting the hunting this very card right here. 1968 Jerry Koosman, Nolan Ryan rookie card. Gonna see it if I can pick one up at the National this year. Uh, really don't care the condition as long as the front is decent visual uh, eye appeal. I will take it. Just want to have uh, an official Ryan rookie in the collection, and that is a pretty nice reprint of that bad boy. And then, definitely last but not least, this also came with the note too, which usually I should have I should have started with this. Oh, come on. My phone keeps uh, busting in some messages or some crap like that. Uh, a note from my boy. Here's here's you a pink card of Tiffany and a note. Pink Chi. Hope you like it, bro. Take care, bro, Meister. It's Yankees card. Junkyard Jerome Moore. He also hooked it up with the crown jewel of my collection now. A super sweet one of one. Let me see. Let me let me show you the back of this first before I before I flip it. You have received relics from three sports authentically used by Junkyard Jerome Mar, 12-time World Arm Wrestling Champion. That's six with the right and six with the left, bitch. We're gonna turn this bad boy over. Look at this custom. Look at that thing bling, boys. I'm gonna put my shades on. I will be right back. <laughs> Look at this custom, handmade by Junkyard Jerome Moore. The pick is from his 2001 National Arm Wrestling Championship. That's actually against the second place dude right there, Ray Henricks. The shirt relic is from when he was competing at the Rising Sun Indiana Tournament. That shirt relic right there. He also, will, let me see, the blah, 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 three-way. The glove is from the Softball League when he won his YMCA Softball League. And the Q-tip is from the stick he shot with his last two years, and he's easily won five grand with that bad boy. Super sweet one-of-one one relic from Junkyard Jerome Moore. Read it and weep, bitches. It's in my collection forever. You wish you could have it. You could offer me up your mantle. It ain't gonna get traded to you. You could offer me up your Mike Trout. It ain't gonna get traded to you. Maybe if you had like a 1990 Jose Canseco All-Star card, though, like Fleer... I might consider it. Just kidding. One of one junkyard Jerome Moore. Look at that thing. Bling. 
Anyways, guys, under 10 minutes. Love you so much. Make sure you spread that love. Spread that positivity. Go check out Yankees cards. You will not be disappointed. RFW Wrestling, where the YouTubers go to hash that shit out. BFRG Sunday nights here on the broadcast. Can't keep plugging all my shit because I just am running out of breath. Love you guys so much. I'll holler at you next time. Oh, 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 oh.